Good morning, good morning. This is Apostle Dixon. I pray that you are having a blessed day in the Lord. Get up praising Him. Praise God. Give Him glory. Give Him hallelujah. For he deserves it all. Worship him in spirit and in truth, saith the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. If you see my scripture on here, it says, Romans 3.18, There is no fear of God before their eyes. Thus saith the Lord that even the church, come on, Samantha, hallelujah, even preachers, pastors, apostles, whatever the case may be, he says that there is no fear of God before their eyes. It is time to get back into a relationship with God. It is time to put God first again. It is time to get on your face again. It is time to fast. It is time to pray, saith the Lord. It is time to push back the plate. It is time, hallelujah. He said that there is too much evil going on to where we're not praying. There should supposed to be more shut-ins. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. Leaders are supposed to be telling people the truth. Oh, come on, somebody. Hallelujah. How can they hear if you are not sent? And how can you be sent if you don't spend time with the Father? Oh, come on, somebody. Hallelujah. So I just pray this morning right now that God actually puts it in your heart to come closer to Him, to get closer to Him. Hallelujah. To fast, to pray like never before. Hallelujah. So that you fall in love again with God. Come on, somebody. Fall in love with your first love. You remember when you first found God or may I say he found you? Do you remember when you used to tell everybody about God? Do you remember when you used to spend time with God? Do you remember when you used to word? I mean, I, how you be so eager for that word. Come on, somebody. Hunger for the word of God. You'll be thirsty. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. Ask God to renew your love. Ask God to renew your strength. Ask God to renew your mind. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. These are perilous times, saith the Lord. Hallelujah. The enemy is rising in this hour, for it should be so, saith the Lord. He said, but also my people should be rising. Hallelujah. Where is the remnant, God says. Hallelujah. Oh, give him glory, give him glory, give him glory. So I pray that God strengthens you emotionally, spiritually, financially. Oh, come on, somebody, hallelujah. I pray that he gives you peace. That's another thing God says. He says, Deanna, they have no peace. You're worrying about this and that. Can I tell you something? You're going to have to learn to trust him. Oh, come on, somebody, hallelujah. When you stay close to God, when you get close to God, you learn how to trust him. Trust him for everything. Trust him. Oh, come on, somebody, hallelujah. A lot of people don't trust God. You love God, but you don't trust God. Because if you did, you would stop doing things your way. God, I trust you. God, I know you're going to keep me, even when I don't understand it, God. Oh, come on, somebody. I will obey you, God. When you don't trust God, you won't obey him. You will do what you want to do. And I promise you, it will cost you every time. People don't understand that. There are consequences no matter what you do, good or bad. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. So God says, trust him in this hour. He said, trust him, obey him, love him, worship him with your whole heart. He said, when they seek me with their whole heart, there should they find me. Oh, come on, somebody. Hallelujah. Give him your whole heart. Stop playing. Stop playing. This is not the time, the place, thus saith the Lord. He says that people are dying needlessly without him because the church have not put him first. It is not about money. It's not about cars, fame, or even a reputation. As a matter of fact, Jesus made himself of no reputation. Oh, come on, somebody catch that in the spirit. Hallelujah. So God bless you. God keep you. I pray that you have a blessed day today. Walk in the blessings of God. Witness to somebody. Go to the highways and the byways. Start allowing God to penetrate your spirit to where when he says, go to them, compel them to come. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. You have to be led by the spirit. And the only way that you can be led by the spirit, unless you hear God. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. So clear your mind. Start spending time with God. Start being obedient with God. I, let me tell you something. The entertainment spirit is really real. People like to be entertained. I'm talking about if, if it's not hollering and hooping and, and shooping and doing all other kind of stuff, people are not, they're not focused. They have a very short attention span. But when you love God, God, what do you say? I want to hear your word. I want to know your word. God, help me. God, keep me. God, reach me. Hallelujah. Come on, somebody. Ain't nobody playing. So God bless you. God keep you. And also this morning, um, at 10 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, I will be gone on the radio. 
I'm a, I'm excited. Um, this is my first time ever being on the radio. I've had a television show, but I've never had a radio show. And um, it's going. It's called Wartime, and you can also catch it on the internet at ninety nine point nine. So um, for those that are in South Carolina, I think it's Wilmington, South Carolina, and uh, Augusta, Georgia, and surrounding areas, you'll be able to hear clear. And also, I was told if you go on the um, internet, I think also I will be doing a live. So stay tuned. Um, praise God. Praise God. All right, you guys, God bless you and God keep you. In Dallas, Texas, what time? Um, I have no idea. I think, um, okay, you guys are like an hour ahead of us. So 10, I think it'll be 9, your time. Please don't quote me, but um, look at the time zones. You know, Google it, the time zones, and um, you should know what time it is, please. All right, God bless you. God keep you. This is Apostle Dixon. Roll out soldiers, for that is who we are. God bless.